Hey everybody, Nolan here, and welcome to video two in my Schlieren series. In video one, I showed you a traditional Schlieren setup in which you use a razor to actually image uh, differences, very slight differences in the density of a transparent fluid such as air. And the hardest thing to get a hold of that you need is a parabolic mirror of pretty decent quality. Um, you're also going to need a point source of light, which is easy to produce uh, a razor and a decent camera. That's really it. Um, it's really, really easy to set up. But in this video, I, I have been experimenting and I want to show you adding color using color filters uh, to the Schlieren setup. Um, it's it's a little more sophisticated to do than a razor, but the results are super duper worth it. Uh, and so I wanna show you some of those images right now. So in this first video, what you're seeing is actually the Schlieren setup with four filters, four different color filters. Um, so when you see yellow, that's the light actually being deflected up. If you see green, it's deflected down. If you see magenta, that's deflected to the right. And if it's blue, that's deflected to the left. So this is my color filter setup with, with four different filters. You can see the yellow is on top, the peacock green is on bottom, uh, and then the, the blue and magenta are on the sides. And this is viewed uh, looking in toward the camera, and so it's oriented actually backwards from what you would see on the screen. Um, the beam that's coming from my point source over here uh, is, is reflecting off of my mirror, um, and it's passing right in between uh, those, those four filters. There's a little gap here uh, that you can kind of see maybe right there, just right in the middle. It's actually passing right between them. Um, and so what that does is that on the screen, as this little beam is deflected up and down uh, by you know whatever my subject is in the Schlieren setup, um, you actually see that those changes, um, the, that deflection up, down, left, right, expressed in different colors. So I, I really have these four different dimensions of color that I'm producing in the Schlieren setup. So uh, just let me show you some more images of uh, Schlieren in, in, in four colors. To light our match, get our candle going. So if I create a little bit of turbulence here, see all those different colors. see those different colors deflected. I'm going to go ahead and pour a little bit of carbon dioxide on that. So I've got my measuring cup here. I've got my vinegar, baking soda and vinegar. Get a reaction going. So that's carbon dioxide right there. Let's put out our flame with the color filters, see what that looks like. See what this looks like. And some helium. See those different colors. Piece of ice here. see some of that cool air sort of deflecting. Sort of sinking down. If I hold it directly above the candle, oh, it's really kind of starting to melt that ice. Cold means hot. Whew. 
Oops. A couple of drops of water.